Oh, and a Aimer's actually gonna rock um, the gunner right now. Cena, all mm -hmm. around character. Mm -hmm. Jack of all trades, solid reach with the sword. Mm -hmm. Should be a good matchup against the gunner. Oh, actually, he's rocking that uh, the little gravity bomb on the bottom. Oh man, that fair is so low. That's so much less than what it used to be. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. How um, Aimer's gonna deal with that? See, oh, there's a forward he's, smash though. It's like I'll I'll deal with it like this. Apparently, 64% damage. Just barely missed the timing on that blast afterwards on the get up. That's definitely gonna be something Riles has to watch out. For. Yeah, actually, that that fair reminds me a lot of Villager. <clears throat> you know, I'm pretty sure he's gonna be playing. Um, he's gonna be using that fair kind of very uh, similar to how Villager oh. would use that uh, the fair in the back air. That's one of those sneaky things too. You gotta respect from the gunner. Oh. You can get the up air through the stage. So it's gonna make those edge guarding situations a lot more dicey. But so far, this has been a pretty even exchange. Yeah. Man, not understanding the properties of how that little bomb works, I'm pretty sure that's what Riles did right there. So he kind of just let it happen. Oh, oh but he got him with the nair into here, the full charge shot. Skeet shooting out here. Mm -hmm. Eight oh, times that's... zoom sniper rifle is going to connect on the first stock. Yeah, Riles. Four, 420 no scope. <laughs> got him. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, that was a good force smash coming in for Riles if he held it a little longer. Because he definitely had the read, but that's oh, a gimp. No. He gimped himself. Riles, why would you do that to yourself? Riles uh, pretty far away from the stage trying to even up on the stocks. That's going to be an easy punish. Yeah, like, I know your fare is really good and all, but you can't go, like, that deep. Right you got to know the limits of your character. And oh, great parry. Oh. That was amazing. That was probably the best parry punish I've seen <laughs> so far. <laughs> With Lucina's quick forward, forward smash, we might see that more often than not. Right now, Amber's going back to the zoning game. It worked out so well for them at the beginning of the match. Mm -hmm. But uh, showing that ability that I can get these parries, I can punish you off of it, that might slow down Amber a bit. Yeah. yeah. Oh, got oh! him. With, that was a confirm. That was beautiful. Uh, that's probably why he plays his character now. <laughs> nice mashup there. Riles is like, am I playing against the Belmont or am I playing against Samus? Because I just got dealt both hands. <laughs> like, it's like literally a combo, but right. literally, <laughs> literally a combo. I mean, that's one of the really cool things about these me characters is that they emulate some of the you know key abilities from different characters. Mm -hmm. You deal, you deal, you get on a ledge. You run into the Belmont equivalent. It's like, okay, let me jump back, try to get my bearings. Oh, there's a Samus ball in my face. Yeah. Oh, wait. <laughs> Find me. Uh, he, <laughs> he's going to go to the disgusting me <laughs> stage. Oh, no, he went to Castlevania Omega. Okay, that's cool. That's that's agreeable. Looks like they're both having a good time over there. Smiles and chuckles. No, Amor is like one of the nicest people in this community, honestly. He's super funny. Just a blast to be around, you know? Lacrom, a nice switch up. We'll see how this works out for Riles. Jumps over the down B. Gamer might have to deal with a bit more speed coming out of the Lacrom, but runs up, gets the grab. Again, trying to establish this offstage pressure. That re grab situation coming in from the falling up air. He oh. did it again. That's so sick. Oh, wait, you can hit yourself with that? Oh, that's the counterplay to that move. Bounces back. You gotta watch out for Amers making some people believers with this meat gunner. I'm sure someone in Twitch chat was like, "Meats, really?" But when you see these combos, this early progression, not bad. Hey, uh, true, true two GG fans. <laughs> no, they already know. <laughs> yeah, this character is interesting, and they know that Amer will do work with them. Oh, got him with that that neutral getup with a forward smash. Stock is going to get claimed. Riles showing that we might see the first game three of the evening. But Amor charges it up. Riles is definitely trying to find some ground game in neutral, but the jumping is proving to be quite a problem. Yeah, it, I feel like once Amor is able to get like a good enough uh, ledge pressure setup, yeah. it's going to be really hard for Riles to get off the corner. But man, I feel like. In terms of just pure neutral, oh, he, he actually gimped himself with that. Like, in terms of pure, pure neutral, Krom is just so strong. 
back on stage can be tough as the crumb. See that exhibit A? Oh! Forward smash just misses. Amers positioning pretty well. Yeah. It's actually really tough for Amer to deal with Crom's fair. I feel like Crom's fair might actually be longer than uh, me gunners. Oh, Ooh. great parry forward smash. Man, people are finally learning how to do, uh, how to make that move work. I'm so um, excited. It, it, it adds such a layer of depth to the overall neutral game. And it's always a hype moment when you see a parry trade for another parry or something like that. Did you see that? Got him. He armored through the first one, and then the second one, it just beat it out. It just sm smashed it right back in, gun in uh, Gunner's face. Oh, there's a forward smash coming out from Riles. He's going to connect. Right now, Riles just has to try to rack up as much damage as he possibly can before this last stock is taken. Might be a tall order, but he's already up to 22%. Doing pretty well for himself. Oh. Uh -oh. Riles making... Um, Kind of putting on the pressure for um, Aimer because Aimer still has to deal with Crumb's kind of disgusting oh! hitboxes. But speaking of a disgusting hitbox, why did that go through from the bottom of the platform to the top? Like we pointed out earlier, the up air through the stage is going to be pretty tough to deal with. You don't see me gunners every day, yeah. so you're not really expecting that. You saw it earlier on, but it definitely will rouse up right there. Yeah, he's never falling for that again. He's like, <laughs> ah, I've been here before. He's going to have man flashbacks of that for sure. The up air into the grab, that falling property to that attack is definitely catching Riles off guard, but he's definitely, he's finding ways to jump back into the game. It's pretty much even right now. There's the throw. We've seen Crom struggle with this Oh, earlier. no! Oh, no! <coughs> he went a little too low. Sad lie.